We've completed the layout of the system and entering all the data. Now we're ready to check the system for errors and do an analysis. To do this, we click on the Analysis tab at the top of your screen and select Error Check. It quickly tells us that it finds no errors in the system. Now we repeat this process and select Analyze System. A number of choices come up. We're going to use the current year and the KY pipe model, so we select Analysis. Them showing us the progress. When the map comes back, the analysis is complete. There's two uh, principal ways to look at the results. There's a tabulated report, which we can turn on and scroll down through. Now this report, because of the width, we won't see everything, but originally we see a summary of the data, lengths, diameters, and node data, elevations, etc. Then we see results like flow rates, head losses, there'll be velocities and other things. For nodes, there'll be hydraulic grade lines and additional results. Uh, we can go back to the map and look at results on the map and print them out. We can see results for each node and for each pipe. And the results that we can see are selected down here, such, such things as flow rates, uh, velocities for pipes, for nodes, pressures, uh, hydraulic grade lines, information like that. We can turn this on. We'll go in and turn on a pipe result. And this will be the flow rate because that's what's selected down here. We can turn on node results. And these will be the pressures because of what's selected down here. Now we could change that. For example, a very useful presentation are the head losses in each pipe and the hydraulic grade lines. So I'm going down here and select the loss from what appears. So there's a 7.9 foot loss in here. I'm going to the node results and select hydraulic grade line. Now the useful, the useful information here is that the grade is 300, the loss is 7.9, so the 292.1 represents the initial grade minus the loss, and so on. So this is a very good overview of what's happening in your network. So this is the procedure for doing the error checks and the analysis. In the next session, we'll look at some different types of analysis and modifying the system.